So one of the things I like to do as the trapper is I like to take the first couple minutes to pick up any nearby traps and place them in choke points. Like this place, this honestly isn't a very good spot to put it, but that's okay. I just don't want to leave this all the way back here on the off chance that I need it later. So we're going to pick it up and we're going to take it with me. I wish I had the trapper bag though so I can carry an extra one. Now these guys... See, here's a good example. Right in between the pallets. <clears throat> this enables me to stop them from going through the pallets relatively quickly. It'll actually put them into a down state if I manage to hit them once. Hello there! I'm gonna get you. Not a bad start, I'd say. Get you! I'm gonna get you. <laughs> you can't play these games with me. I'm faster than you. Somebody's over there too. Oh God! Please don't tell me it's gonna be just like every other fucking game. Yeah, I'm gonna stand right here. There's a little secret I know too. I have a trap. I got a trap. Set a trap real quick. Ah, uh, so annoying. See, this is what people do. They play together like this and they think, Oh, I'm gonna be clever and I'm gonna try to save my friend. But here's the problem. None of you are working on generators now. Two minutes has gone by and you don't have a single generator. Think I don't know what's happening here? Think I'm dumb? I know how to play this game. I've played it many times. Oh, wow! It's almost like somebody saw that coming. So you're just gonna sit right there. Let's see, are there any nearby hooks? Uh, none that I really want to go to, so we're just gonna hang out right here. And this is to prevent somebody from coming over and reviving this guy, and then, say, pilling off his buddy here. And, you know, honestly, this is the best kind of gameplay, if you ask me. Because these dum-dums think that I don't know what they're going to try and do. They think that the best way to win this game is to stay together. Oh. Can you just stay right here, buddy? Yeah, keep crawling. I'm going to stay right here until your buddy dies. Now, a lot of survivors get really angry when you sit here in camp, but honestly, it's the only way to combat people who work together in the way that they just sit there and try to body block the killer. So, ain't nobody coming for this guy now. So I'll just keep an eye on little Bill over there. Wait for this guy to go ahead and die. Now, we've gone through about four minutes here, I believe, which means that these guys, in their four minutes, have only gotten one generator and started another. That's going to make it real easy for me to take these guys out in a few minutes. Now, I seem to have lost Bill here. But that's okay. He's still down somewhere. He's in the vicinity. I'm just having a hard time seeing him because of the fog. So here's what we'll do in the meantime. Maybe he went this way. I don't see any blood. So where did you go, Bill? You're gonna bleed out eventually. And then nobody can save you. Oh, I heard him. There he is. Hi, Bill. Ooh, somebody sprinted near here, too. That means somebody was about to save him. Oh, hi! Yeah, I can see you. You're not clever. See, now this is a mistake that a lot of new players make. They think that the best way to win is to make sure everybody is alive. However, that's often the biggest mistake they make. The best thing you can do is have a distraction, have another player. Where are you going? Oh man, that sucks. You're both down now. Man, it's like I was ready for that or something. Oh. This is so satisfying. 
This is truly, truly satisfying. I'm just gonna pick this up. Well, you guys should be proud of yourselves. You got two generators before three of you almost went down. You're gonna hang out right there. I'm gonna trap this again. Now, Dayman hasn't made an appearance yet, so I don't think he will personally, but I'm just gonna follow this person around. Oh, look, another trap. Cool. Great. This will make it a lot easier. So I'm just gonna hang out right here and wait for so and so to die. Now, unfortunately, this is kind of the only way to combat people who like to just dick around instead of doing the objectives. And it's often that you'll run into people like this online. Yeah, well, he's dead. So here's what we're gonna do. Oh man, there's a hook right here. Excellent. So now what you've done is now you've fucked two of your allies, and potentially the third, because you guys wanted to hang out together. Mm. Boy, is that satisfying. Aww. You wanna play? Okay, we're entering a new phase now. Now, because there's only one person left alive, the hatch is going to open. And that means that whoever is left alive has an opportunity to escape almost effortlessly. All they have to do is find the hatch. And in turn, all I have to do is find the hatch before they do. Oh, uh, but they gave themselves away by finishing a generator. That is unfortunate. See? The hatch is an easy way to get away, because once you find it, it's open. It's always open. It immediately opens. And from then on out... All you have to do is jump in. Now they're gonna try and go through a window. Probably pull down a pallet. Hi! I'll get a little speed boost, and then they'll keep running. Wow! Way to fuck that up. Oh, it's so good, though. Mm. This is just about what every game I play is like. I end up usually doing pretty goddamn well. And on top of that, these guys just don't know how to play. They think that they need to save their allies every time they jump on the hook, but you don't. <gasps> and you were close to the hatch! Ah, oh, so close. You almost made it out alive. Well, that's a good game. The farm. Okay. I can roll with that. So we're gonna do what we always do. We're gonna take our traps and we're gonna place them ahead of time. So, like one right here. I'm gonna go get this trap. Make sure we take it with us. Because we're gonna need it later. Well, first things first. I'm gonna put this here, so that somebody runs into it, and they try to repair the generator. My friends, the crows, are keeping me updated. Now, I'm expecting them to be finishing a generator any time now. Oh, hi. What are you doing? AFK. <sighs> Fine. No, if you don't struggle. Oh, they they are struggling though. That's interesting. Maybe they're dis the distraction. This here. Now we're just gonna take a take a look around and see if anybody's coming to help you. I think I just saw somebody back there. Turning. Ooh, we got out of that one quick. And this side here. 
I'll probably pull that person off the hook, but that's okay. Just gonna take a look, see here, see what's going on here. Well, there's their generator. Good. Making some progress. So now that we've checked this area, we'll head back to our hooked friend. Make sure nobody's trying to. Make sure nobody's trying to save him. More so because I just want to keep the hook or keep the bear trap, but you know. This here. Now, off chance anybody tries to come over here and repair this one, it's time for you to go. Let go now. Goodbye. You can stay here now. Somebody is sprinting. <gasps> it's my injured friend. Come. Come to my birthday party. Nope, not quick enough. Come on. You're gonna join the birthday bash too. Right on over here. Come on. I see you there. Man, I wish I had a trap though. If I'm really quick, I can go over here and grab it. Maybe they're trying to escape, though. They know nobody's coming for them. worried about. It's okay though. You know why? I'm gonna get you. Ooh. Good one. That was a really good delay. But that's all it is. A delay. You know why? Cause you're gonna die. Cause you're still running. I see you. Hello! Hello! Oh, poor girl. And unfortunately for you, I happened to grab a trap on my way over here, so... Oh, and there's another one right next to it, too. Great. It's gonna be nice and easy. Here's what we're gonna do. You can go here. Mm -hmm. oh, somebody is just here. Man, that was stupid. Here you go. This is for you. I want you to have this. It's important to me. You should just let go. Ooh, this is gonna be a long run. I'm okay leaving that person there, though. I'm confident that Fire Angels are gonna go back for him. Oh, or are they? They just might make it. Here. Ah, oh, ha, ha! The trap! Guess who's coming for you? It's me! Aw, oh, poor girl. Man, they really just have no chance this time around, do they? Trap here. Um, yeah, why not? We'll put another trap here. I doubt she'd remain in the vicinity after being injured already. So, what I'll do is I'll go to the top of that hill and I'll get that trap. That'll give me a bit of a bird's eye view here. Oh, uh, see, now this is the mistake everybody makes. Just like the last game. Instead of going for the objectives, they're too focused on each other. 
you have to expect that at some point one person is going to get hooked. And it's okay if they take a lot of damage while they're on the hook. It's going to happen. It's normal. What you're supposed to do is keep working on the objectives. The objectives are the only thing that's going to get you out of here. Unless your plan is to wait out the timer. Oh boy. Man, it's, this game almost wasn't even fun. I mean, it was really fun, but it almost wasn't fun. Well, this could be problematic. I may not make it to the hook in time. I don't think this person knows what a hatch is, though. Oh, I got it. Good game. Man, that was a really short one. I'm okay with that, though. I'll take those blood bucks. Any way I can get them. <sighs> Good.